tiffed right here. We already have three over. No one has invested a point in anything except Ogre. He actually did put a point right now into the Fire Blast. And I'm looking for a gang breakout right now in this bottom. Here we go. Come on. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Dirty. He's going to go right in there. And he goes right on PSM. But the Fire Blast is going to try to slow his roll. Nice sleep, though. Going to prevent Tipper from getting anything. And that, just like that. First one's actually hero and uh, disruptor and Wisp is gonna go down here. Yeah, Wisp. He's a little too far uh, for right there, and he's gonna tether back and okay, get KPD, glimpsed. Okay, KPD, gonna die too. Oh, what? Uh oh, what? 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 Oh, because they're gonna need their own help as far as uh, snowball towards this mid game. But right now they're pressing on in. They're gonna make a move on J4. Fire Blast leads it off. Thunder Strike. Coil is well committed for this one. Bane stands his ground though, as he's gonna get back up right now get from left. that Legion commander. But up on. Dead. Oh no, the sleep. Oh, they're the doing it out. Matt sleeps on in through. <laughs> Big damage, but he jaunts away from this one. No one to fall yet. And uh, now, Ogre testing. A bit. Kinetic Field's going to lock him in place, but no one's eating big damage, and it is going to be eventually the puck who goes down. Good work from Power Rangers to converge towards oh, this. The disruptor's going to be in trouble here. They're creeping on him. They got blinking last, so they can go now if they want. Steps in, Kinetic Field, but they're just going to pull out the Fiend's Grip. Very easily, and he should be able to right-click him down. He can even preserve the lasso. But hey, the whole party's here. Why don't we just keep on pushing forward? Ogre and Medusa are also in the neighborhood. If uh, PR want to keep pressing forward, they're going to go ahead and press on in. Can they get the duel off? They do. It's going to be Medusa versus the Legion Commander. But Legion Commander might fall here, and she does. But it's not going to be long enough for her to gain the bonus damage. Medusa now slept. It looks like Ogre is going to turn on Bane. Bane, desperation TP. Can he get away from this one? Oh, he can. He gets coiled and locked down. Medusa still lives. KPG now. Gorak on this timber saw. He does have his arcane boots, so he's got a little extra sustain. Oh, they, they, uh, they see him. And uh, he quickly flies over the ledge right now. He's got to play careful, though. He's creeping in here. Gets a stack off, but there's a glimpse back. They're going to get a hold of J4 right now. Bat might need to consider helping out his Bane ally. And Bane, going to get first back, pulls up the sap and sleep there on Timbersaw, but it is going to be Disruptor who's first to fall. Duel does come out right now, and they're pulling him away from the duel, but they still manage to take him down. A winner there, finally, for Legion Commander. And now they get a hold of Gorev with that Fiend's grip. They lock him in place, and they finish him off. So PR able to strike back with their own successful skirmish. Oh, top, oh, top lane. lane. They do finally jump in. They get a hold of the Ogre. It's going to be Bat Ray to lead it off. Immediately three TPs to come. But their ogre friend is already down, pushing on in. He's got to be cautious, though. They're going to look to move on in. He's got Glimpse, Static, uh, Storm, everything ready to go. And Orb all the way in. Coil could also lock him in place. They're going to commit for this one. Glimpse sends him all the way back into a Static Storm. And uh, Batrider jumps in, trying to help his ally. And the relocate as well, but it's going to be too late. Slardar does end up going down. Slark, God damn it. Meanwhile, with trying to save and help out Legion Commander in the duel. Does get the duel. Does not get the victory, though. Still a little too long. Wisp ends up going down, and Legion Commander, it's also going to fall. Bang! Long ball, Timber Chain gets it done. Oh, I thought he was going to Fiend's Grip him or something. That could have... Uh-oh. Hey, oh, no. Puck, how's it going? Bat right uh, here. And he goes on in. He right clicks if he can get it. She can't get away from this. Yeah, no. blink. Boom! Yeah. Nice quick grab right there. Ogre, PR, they are... Ogre to the face. It's, uh, it's all oh. Oh, yeah. It's it's Ogre for sure. Oh, no, oh wait, Wisp. Wisp, Wisp. Come on. Keeping him alive. Oh, the we're forced down. away, too. Wisp Come is putting in overtime right now with his overcharge, trying to save out his ally. And Ogre's going to overcommit and get the free dual kill. Went for the Yules instead of the... In, instead of the... Whoa. That's oh. aggressive blink. Yules can help against Batrider, though. He's got a Yule. Oh. He can Yule him. Oh, he doesn't oh. want to use it though. Two times multi catches Bat and they glimpse him all the way back and eventually do take him down and Timber try to finish that one off. Meanwhile, Stonegate is going to be popped. Does lock J4 in his place and J4 might be trouble. He does use the sap to get a little bit of life back and now Legion Commander jumps in, gets a hold of the Disruptor, does get the winner duel, but he might fall now to uh, Precious Blade and Medusa. Plus the gem is going to be picked up right now. And now, looking to clean out another, it's Slark who ends up on our test. Really putting in right now with the uh, assist game that was brought forward by the rest of his team. But he's going to see Bane. No, he's not going to see Bane. Oh, no, he's he is going to see Bane. He's got a gem. Hi, how you doing? That was a free kill. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. And also invested that Demon Edge into a Daedalus. So it's not going to be the MKB. And there's your butterfly on Slark. So uh -oh, here they jump go. in duel. They take out Puck just like that. Medusa sweeps on in, pops out her stone gaze, and they're trying to run out from this one. But uh, LC's not going to be so lucky, even with that BKB popped in. Wow, Slark also gets obliterated. Uh-oh. That is unfortunate for them. And now PR quickly handing over one after the other. Hey, Creeping on in, they pop the uh, glyph, but uh, ultimately they're they're going to get slow siege. But yeah, they're, they're actually muscling down mid lane pretty good here. The racks are going to fall, and they're forced to pull out a glyph. Oh, look at this. KPG are creeping back. No TP on Medusa. No TP on this guy. No TP on this guy. No one has a TP. They're losing the mid lane. 
Ryu, what the hell's happening? They are going to top now! Dude, you're all robotic. What is going on? And meanwhile, they're getting caught out from Bane. Bane's putting them all to sleep! <laughs> and they can't get back in time! Oh man, oh man, Puck is finally here, creeping forward, tier 3 is about to go down, he desperately pulls out the Carly gets blown up instantly! Oh my god, PR now! Taking down another set of racks! Coil buys back, he buys back, he gets to go in! Do something, you lose your base! Oh boy, PR man! They make a very great ballsy call right now, and they're gonna about to benefit from huge siege damage on the structures. They take down two sets of racks, Wisp gets out, Slark gets oh, out. Oh, they have the option now. It is just so bad. Oh, there. Hello. Hello. All right. Sorry, it was Sounds it wasn't even letting the answer. Meanwhile, yeah, they're jumping in on Wisp. We can't we can't deter too far. They're gonna quickly try to burst him down, but he's actually still still fine. Nope, never mind. Yeah, he's gone. <laughs> that was a quick uh, timber saw takedown right there, but they're keeping pressing forward right now. Uh oh, they would love oh, to get hold of Slark. She got ulti before she oh, the buyback Wisp. He comes in to aid him about. Quickly leeches up with him. Batrider gets a nice grab on that Medusa, pulls him up and above to the high side, and that's no Aegis anymore. So that'll look to press on through. Slark cleans up with a double right now. Medusa still lives. She's like the last hurrah right now for KPG to try to duke it out, but she's very, very low. Slark's gonna move in and clean her up and gets it done. Holy moly, Slark is cleaning house right now. The gem is down once more. He quickly escapes, and he is rich. Scrooge McDuck right now, near 6,800 gold. And Power Rangers have quickly taken this game back. After the back end of bursting down the base. Though they are uh, losing a couple still. They might lose a couple of lingering offlaners and supports as Batrider is going to get caught out eventually as well. Uh-oh. Oh, oh. Trying to fly up and above and away from this one, but they get the Yules off. Oh, Slark dances in. Ready to make a fight happen right now and pick off and make him pay, but Batrider ultimately does go down. He's trying to get a hold of the uh, pesky uh, puck. That's not going to be fortunate. Can he get out in time? Yes, he can. Nice quick escape right there from Timber Sus. Sends him back to base if they are not careful. Oh, he goes for it though. He makes the jump in. And he's going toe-to-toe -to -toe here. It's a tough shell of Kraken. Look at this. It's that easy. KPG were oh, all there and nearby in the neighborhood. That was a very unfortunate jump in coming out from PR. Yeah. Hey, you, you need the you even need to put the Timber Sus double first with the shock. Well they press down the mid lane and they're gonna do some siege damage here, but uh We'll see how it works out for him. Slark's not buying back. He's going to nurse it. Doesn't want to invest the extra bit of money if he doesn't have to. He'd rather go into a fight and then reserve that buyback kick to go bad. But it's going bad for his team. They put on four, get a nice coil, quickly take down the bat who does buy back. And eventually Slark is going to have to buy back, and he does. As they take that one racks, but KPG yeah, are looking for kills die. instead. They're going to try to get a hold of Slark. If he goes down, he's done. And uh, he is trying his best. Have an egg at the do so. Oh man, they're gonna have to take her down twice though. He cleans out the disruptor support, now turns the attention towards Puck and has to go off to the side. Medusa does get caught out with the lasso, pulled all the way back in. But meanwhile, Timbersaw trying to open up here. Wisp is trying to save out the Slark and all that life back. Medusa going toe to toe as they hold her in place with a nice duel. Gets slept up briefly, very low life. Oh, she gets healed up just like that. And is trying to slither herself out of this one. Afro Ninja dominating streak for him. Slark does still live, but he's got very low life. And they only take the one set of racks. Puck is going to stay and try to finish what they started, though, and they do get it. And last oh, joint, but no, Slark catches, catches up with him. Self fuels, lock him in place briefly. Oh, the turn. But he will go down. Man, oh man. Holy cow, that Doofus made like the big, not lucky skill. All skill, baby. He that double clink clink. He should have blinked in and hit him with his club and then stunned him. Oh, uh -oh. Nice grab right there. He eats a three times and a four times multi. Should've oh BKB. no, Wisp. He didn't BKB. Now Wisp, rest in pieces, my friend. Oh no, Wisp is going to go down. And Ogre does as well. Oh, right, top lane though, they're going into the base. They get a full Fiend's Grip here on Medusa. And they're going to try to burst her down right he now. The, he got the but Stone she, Gaze off. That's oh, terrible. Oh man. Big Stone Gaze allows her to open up and she gets a little bit of extra damage. But Slark's trying to take her down and does so. She has no buyback whatsoever for 100 seconds. Slark's is trying to clean this one out, but he might be caught out now. Very, oh, very low missed. on life. He also will have That's no bad. buyback if he goes down. And he quickly gets away. That is huge. Now, Medusa needs 500 gold yeah, to be able to come back in this lasso, one. Timber saw, all the glimpse. back. No BKB. Not going to get the opportunity. Oh, they're going in. They're going to quickly open up. They take... Oh, nice Yule save temporarily, but that uh, might be unfortunate here as he does manage to clean out both the Disruptor and that takes out the Timber as well. He's got a low death timer because of that Bloodstone. 
Moves in from Mana, but here we go, trying to sneak on in. It's going to be Legion Commander. Can't get the duel off just yet, but there's going to be your sleep, so he can't really open up on him yet. Flame Break locks him back. And a Disruptor. And they here are just flirting. Slurk. Look who's coming Mark in from behind, coming. though. Dit Yara moving on in, trying to get a hold of Timber. Timber should be able to get away, but the sleep will lock him in place. Pounce forward, locks him down. He's going to try to right click him home. Two times multi. No BKB. He's eating the full damage right now. Silenced up. And Yules. Oh, can he blink away? Pounce. No, he can't. He goes down. He has. He does have a buyback. 100 seconds for him. Going to look to quickly grab that up, and it's going to be on PR to maybe make a big, big haymaker of a play. Relocate back to or something. You back, buddy? Uh, I can barely hear you. Yeah, okay, hold on. They're making a go right now. They quickly take down Bane. Bane does have a buyback. He's down for 70 seconds. They're quick teeping back in the base because they do do that relocate and they're going right for their shrine. Oh man, Wisp is going to be bursted down. If they take him out, he won't relocate back and now Slark is locked here. His BKB is over. He is desperately trying to right click at home. And Medusa, who is already duking it out by the Roche Pit, takes down the Legion Commander. And that leaves Slark to his own devices, who does manage to get the TP off. And heads right back to that bottom lane. And they get... Where are they going? They're going to go back to go back to base or something. They're going to go right down the bottom lane. Meanwhile, they get a hold of Medusa. They're going to pull her all the way back right now. And they're trying to linger it back as much as possible, because meanwhile, Slark is going to go right for the throne and hit it home. And uh, that's going to pull out some TPs right now from KPG, but they are trying their best to save it on out. But Slark is going in right now. It's halfway down. On the throne, he's going right for it, and he might be able to get it. No one's coming back, now they are. It takes it down to about nearly a third life. BKB's going to be popped, he's still right-clicking it. And they do not have a glyph, but they'll be able to focus him down. If he does fall, he has no buyback. He jumps all the way off to the right-hand side. Can they get him out before he TPs away? They can. They burst him, they glimpse him all the way back. He is still trying to make it away from this one. Pounces up and above. They do not burst through the tier fours as they still are on the hunt trying to get a hold of him. Medusa is now in it, but he ultimately gets away. Man, oh man, he is so slippery. But he is getting in and out and getting the damage done. Your, sh your shrine's only down to 800 life. They're coming from behind and they're going to right click it now. He jumps over the other side. He's going to right click. He's going to get it done. He gets it done. This Slark, what a player. Slippery plays coming out. The constant backdoor, the constant pressure, the big play that gets it done. That takes down two sets of racks, pretty much secures the game and allows PR to get opportunities like that to come right on 